This video is a walkthrough on how to fill out the Arrive Can app, which you need upon returning to Canada from outside of the country. So once you've downloaded the app, the Arrive Can app from the Google Play Store or the App Store, for Apple users onto your device. Once you launch it, you're going to get this screen and then you're going to hit start. First screen is how are you entering Canada, air, land, or sea? Next, it's going to ask for your flight details. Which country are you arriving from? Which airport are you? is your first point of entry into Canada? The airline and the flight number. After you've entered that, you can save and close at any time and then go back into it. Or if you hit the arrow button, it goes to the next screen. So the next one is going to ask you a couple questions on your purpose of travel. And then it's going to ask you to register your travel document. And most people, that's going to be a passport. So it'll pull up the camera. And once you get it in the right spot, it will um, recognize it and go to the next screen and fill in the information for you. Make sure it's correct. And at this point, you can add another traveler if you'd like. Then you need to fill in your contact information. Um, next question is, have you had a COVID vaccine? And you answer yes or no. And then I'll come to this screen where you um, enter your proof of vaccination. When and what type of vaccine did you get for your first shot? And then have you had your second one? Same thing. It's going to ask which type a vaccine did you get and the date and also which country you received them in. Then the next screen is going to ask you for a photo for proof of the first and second vaccination. You can either take a picture if you have it in front of you or if you already have a picture on your camera, you can select that option as well. So as you can see, it's pretty quick. It doesn't take very much time at all. So there's dose one, dose two. And then on the next screen, it's going to say that you understand that you need to have a negative PCR test in order to return back into Canada, no, taken no more than 72 hours prior to arrival. And then um, it's going to ask you which... Um, if you have that test and where you re where that test was taken. Also, if you've traveled to any other country uh, besides the one you already listed. Next, it's on to the quarantine plan questionnaire. And um, it's going to ask you for a, li a little bit of information about um, where you're going home to from the airport, if it's a hotel or a place of residence. A little bit of information about that and the people that may be around you or in contact with. And then if you are wherever you're going to, hotel, home, staying with friends or other, it's going to ask you for the address. And it is, it is Google powered there as, as you can see. So once you start filling it out, you may, um, you can just select whichever address it is. It'll auto populate, make sure it's correct. And then go on to the next, um, page where it asks how you're feeling today. Are you feeling well? Yes or no. And then after that, it's all finished and you can just hit the submit button and then you will get um, either an, a text or an email or QR code that you're going to be asked for at Can Canadian uh, Customs when you arrive. Thank you so much. And if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments. Thank you.